I welcome you all for taking out your precious time and coming for the inauguration of Chakri Yoga. Chakri Yoga was started with a mission to provide the world authentic healing and therapies by way of workshops and seminars. So, what I can say to you all that this mission is going to be a big mission and you all are blessed to have been uh, able to take our time and come here. My presentation is on the concept of Chakra Yoga. For this, I would like to take you on a journey from being human to being divine. Hamsa, I am that, is the most natural mantra we breathe in and out every second of our lives. So Ham is another mantra which translates to I am that. Tat Tvam Asi is one of the Mahavakyas of Vedantic Sanatan literature. Sai Baba said, I am God. You too are God. The only difference between you and me is while I am aware of it, you are completely unaware. After 84 million births through which your consciousness evolves from the basic foundation to the higher level, you finally take birth as a human being. You are sent with a specific purpose by the Creator, which is your life purpose of living in this world. The universal consciousness is a sum total of the ever-evolving, ever-pervading consciousness and the mass consciousness. Your life purpose which was embedded in you is to evolve you and to also serve the humanity in a major way. You were specifically designed for the life purpose. Your life conditions where you were born were chosen as part of the purpose. Your innate personality traits Physical features, talents were given to you for the work you were meant to do. This alone will give you fulfillment. This alone is your dream. What gives you happiness and what you are meant to do is to connect with your life purpose, connect with your heart and achieve your dreams. Nothing gives you more happiness. It is not the materialistic things. It is not the money. It is not the name and acclaim. What gives you true happiness is the achievement of your purpose. On top of that, you have not come only to experience. You have come to be a conscious creator. You want to intentionally direct and create what you want. Your greatest desire is to be enlightened. You wish to know who you truly are, what you can do, and how you can go about doing it. Your chakras are meters through which you live in this world. You have seven major chakras from the base of the spine till the top of your head. They govern different emotions, actions, senses, and organs. They teach you lessons different lessons in life on dharma, earth, calm and moksha. They make you understand the laws of life. They connect you to earth, which is the purpose of your birth. They help you fulfill your karma, your desires through your senses. And finally, they take you on the path of moksha, which is liberation. They drill you through the school of experiences by throwing challenges your way. They test you by throwing obstacles in your path to qualify your success up the ladder of life of personal, materialistic and spiritual success. As you face the obstacles and challenges with realized wisdom and learn from your mistakes and failures, you are promoted to the next level of challenges. But if you develop fear, you stagnate at one level and then life throws more challenges to you, more tougher ones, so that you realize your wisdom, transcend the fear and march ahead. 
life keeps on qualifying you for success success is used as a motivator and failure as a teacher together they navigate you to the higher planes of life the chakras close when fears are developed and open when you learn the lessons correctly closing of chakras attracts more problems and struggles and you develop diseases of the chakras fears of instability less confidence low self esteem mistrust jealousy ego discontentment block the chakras and you develop diseases of body pains thyroid migraines allergies diabetes all because of blockages of chakras you develop impurities of lust greed illusions attachments ego all because of blockages of chakras to learn these lessons one birth is not enough you take birth after birth whatever you learn in one birth is carried forward in the next birth in every birth you fulfill your desires through your senses and live your human experience but finally a birth comes when you reach you reach a certain level of maturity and you realize that you are trapped you are trapped in this maya in this karmic cycle of desires and fulfillment now you yearn to come out you yearn to realize your life purpose you yearn to realize who you are what are your powers what you can do and how you can go about doing it for this learning towards knowing yourself you have choice to take help of bhakti yog this is selfless service and devotion towards god what meera and surdas practiced or gyan yog or chakra yog where reality is realized through insight and knowledge or karma yoga where through perfection of action you live your life purpose or dhyan yoga where meditation practices and kriyas help you connect to your higher self as lessons are learned you elevate in all ways in life personally materialistically and spiritually you realize lessons that you are supported you are a creator you are powerful you are generous you can trust you can express you can communicate you realize lessons of acceptance and contentment through the opening of chakras every chakra opening only empowers the third eye chakra the agnya chakra and this is your mind your intelligence you start tuning more and more to your intelligence and you make your subconscious mind conscious now you are ready to become a channel of the higher consciousness to guide you and to work through you to take you to higher levels to achieve your life purpose for this you need to release all the imperfections impurities attachments and transcend all the chakras and go beyond all the attachments of human birth and awaken the third eye the agnya chakra the mind completely this is the mission of chakra yoga where we aim to bring you living enlightenment freedom and perfection through workshops and seminars namaste